So I've been working here on my garage trying to get it organized somewhat. I got a wall over here that um, I just pile wood up against and I'm just trying to make like a wood rack so that I can store this stuff on and clean it up. And this is what it looks like. Um, as you can see, uh, I just got wood leaning up against the wall here. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and assemble a rack and hopefully I can clean this up. The rack is going to be on wheels so I can roll it in here and out of here and also it's going to have a station that I can put the miter saw on and cut it outside when I need to. So hopefully I'll have more videos here of the building process. Okay so I went ahead and cut the bottom 36 inches long and I went ahead and mitered this groove along the center so I can put a piece straight up uh, that's four foot high and I'm going to glue and screw that to the bottom of it. Here's the bottom that I cut. See right there is the groove that's three eighths inch. It's three quarter inches wide by three eighths inch deep. And I'm going to. I went ahead and drilled holes in there already, so I can see from the other side uh, where to put the screws at. So I'm going to go ahead and put the four foot piece in that groove, glue it, and screw it. Here it is with the upper right screwed to the bottom of it. And what's going to happen is 20 inches down from the top, I'm going to hinge it so that I can lay it down and use it as a miter saw stand. Cut out my bin boards there to represent the sides and the middle boards. I've went ahead and I've attached one already. You can see it there on the corner. And I've went ahead and pre-drilled my holes for the other ones to be installed. I'm going to go ahead and put them on right now. I'm going to go ahead and glue them and screw them. Here it is with all four bins installed, or all three bins installed, all four boards, and that's what it's going to look like. The top part I'm going to cut and hinge so I can lay over and use as a bench for my miter saw. It's going to be a multitasking wood storage bin. Applied to the front of the bins and that's about it for this. So I've cut the top off and now what I've done is I've went ahead and put the side rack on it's going to go ahead and support the plywood. It's laying on its side right now so it's kind of difficult to envision it but this is what I got. I went ahead and supported the bottom or reinforced the bottom with this 2x4 frame on the outside and I'm going to go ahead and screw three inch casters to this so I can easily move it around in and out of the garage. Go ahead and put the four casters on underneath there, screwed them on with 5 16 inch and a half lag screws and it rolls around just fine. So I should be able to stack wood on this thing and go ahead and move it in and out the garage as I need it. Got it all finished up. I even got wood in some of the bins there. What I did was I went ahead and I attached these uh, hinges to it and the reason for that was so I can double this as a workbench. So I bring my miter saw out and I set my motor, miter saw on top of there and I can use it as a work uh, as a workbench, miter saw table, whatever have you. So it's worked out great. It saved me a lot of room. And um, this is it. So if you got any questions, let me know. I'll be happy to send you plans if you're interested in building something like this yourself. Thank you for watching Every Other Day Woodworking.